What's going on everybody? AMF 1534 here. Let's play some more Metal Combat Falcon's Revenge. Last time, things started getting a little bit hard, and I don't mean that in the ways of a boner. I mean, these two guys here actually handed us some losses, with Wong being the guy that did the first one. This definitely was like the hardest fight so far in the game by a long shot. We died like six times. But now, we've put the past behind us. Time to move forward to Moonbase Luna, which this fight's not going to be very much fun either. Because Mr. Uh, Mr. Goldblum over here, even though this has nothing to do with Jeff Goldblum whatsoever, this isn't going to be fun because he is so relentless with that gun. It's so ridiculous. And his shots are insanely fast. Like, good luck blocking them all. You better have some insanely good hand-eye coordination or you're going to pay. <laughs> you better hope that you can take off that gun pretty damn quick. You just gotta get lucky. Really is, is the name of the game here. It's a really long, tedious fight, so get ready to strap yourself in for the ride. You can only hope that you can catch him on a, on a good shot here. Because it's pretty much gonna be machine gun all goddamn day to block these things. There we go. Took off one of his old. Oh no! <laughs> okay, well this definitely got a lot easier just now. Having that shield not being there definitely makes this a world easier. Because now he can't block half of everything on the right side of his body. However, now he's just going to have more outlets to shoot from. God, shut up, Viscount, my lord! Just fucking knock it off, you know? Take some fucking might all and sit down and shut up. Darn it. Stop shooting that thing for a fuck. Oh no! Ooh. Yep, that's the big move right there. As soon as you start seeing the smoke coming out of the back, that's when you know you got a problem. You gotta be so damn difficult, Viscount. Jesus Christ. Yeah, if you think it's bad on this difficulty, wait till the hard comes in. Ooh, perfectly placed, right in the guts. Hey yeah, There it is! God, that was almost a two-minute fight! <sighs> Beat that, you little trout sniffer. I'm not apologizing to Buzz. I'd rather kiss a toilet seat. Oh, dear lord. Oh, not Thanatos. Oh, great. Well, I will say one thing. At least it's really cool. <laughs> if this stage didn't have really cool music and Thanatos was awesome, I would hate this place. I mean, I already do. Because it's... Uh, yep, good old green man. A lot of very large uh, everybody being green and blue theory thing going on right now. But... Yeah. It's just... Uh, I think I know what it is, actually. I think they take, like, the... like. Block at all. I think they're taking like the colors and like inverting them or something. I don't know if I don't think inverting blue gives you green. Oh shit! Don't you dare! I think you can get away with a shot like that. No, no, that's not what I said. That's really not what I said. I am having a very sloppy outing right now. This is also a very tedious fight because he has so many little miniature bullshit shots that he shoots at you. Yo! I'm just I'm waiting for a big move here. I just hope he doesn't do it, because he's gonna start throwing the hands and throwing the feet and everything. You don't hear it yet though. Oh, that's a powerful one. Shit. Alright, well that wasn't quite as bad because we took one of his arms off. That definitely makes that attack not as good. Shit. Shit. God, Thanatos, calm down, man. Get off the void trip. Oh, he killed me. Wow, I did not expect that shot to do that much. Well, fucking hardy har hardy you too, Mr. Thanatos. <sighs> Let's 
That's what I don't like about these. Everybody's gotta have so many goddamn projectiles. <laughs> Good old Thanatos and this creepy laugh by Mr. Anubis. This fight's not nearly as hard as Griffin is, it's just, I mean, it's, it's equally as tedious, but it's not as hard. I just, uh, I didn't have a very good outing there. Wow, how did I fit that in between his, his arm and his midsection? I don't know, I managed to pull that off, but I am not doing so hot again. It's a shame that these bombs don't do a whole lot. Right? What the fuck is going on? What just happened there? That was really weird. It's like I tried to shoot and then my gun just, it's like my gun jammed up. Even though that is impossible, because these aren't real guns and I don't think they jam. I think that I must have just hit the right click button a couple too many times. Ugh. Oh. Well, that's frustrating. Uh-huh. Well, I know I'm not gonna use the wide bomb, so I shouldn't even have it selected. Maybe that'll make my shooting troubles easier. Alright, green man, stop giving me the green shit and I'm gonna, I'm gonna really give it to you. Yeah, shot you right in the balls. Right in your little alien robotic balls. Right in the midsection. Okie dokie. Not gonna get that shot off. Will, however, get that one off. And all of those. Alright, Thanatos, I get the fucking program. Please let me get that one first. Good God alive. There we go. Oh no, I know who's next. Fuck. Oh, dude. I've been tripping this whole time. I thought that the last dudes were hard to do to Rachnus is next. Mr. I can't shoot you in the belly, otherwise it's going to be the Ballad of Irving out here, getting shot outside the Frontier Deli. That's what that's going to be. We're going to have enough time to take a couple of cracks at him, hopefully I can get lucky, because he's not an easy dude either, he's got just about as many projectiles as everybody else. Oh boy. I don't want to have to blow the white bomb on him. <laughs> uh, sorry, that was gross. Yeah, it's not going to be easy, especially with how small of a window that I have to hit him with. You can only hit him in his, you know, upper body area. Anything in his midsection is just going to pretty much spell doom for you. And I don't mean the cool kind of doom like the game, I mean it's going to be fucking like your ass is going to be inside of a casket doom. Alright, here's Mom! Because I need that, because I've done pretty much nothing to him already. Shit. There we go. See, I like when I like when he does his big moves, because that gives me at least an opportunity for a third of a second. Ooh, it's the second time he's become stationary. Oh shit. Oh come on. I, yeah, I totally hit him. Ooh. He's like pooping out those things at me. They're coming right out of his butt. Right out of the old Guadal Canal. This is way too close for a fight right now. I don't like it. No. Yeah. I feel like a parent, like, slapping my child's hand. Oh, I got him. Yes. Fucking awesome. I definitely dodged a bullet there. I usually have such a huge problem with him. I got really lucky that he definitely went stationary, like, three different times during that fight. And now we even have enough time to go at Cobra. I'm gonna take it right to right to the old rings of Saturn. Who's uh whose special move was that in wrestling? I know that I got a few viewers that can answer that one. Was that who had the rings of Saturn? Who was that? It wasn't by chance Saturn, was it? Wow, he's got he's all murdered out with the red. Oh no, he's such a dick with that shield though. If, you'll see what I mean. It, it gets ridiculous. You have to trick him, though. You still gotta trick... And his window of time that you have to shoot him with is a lot shorter. So you gotta really know how to time it. Like that. That's, like, exactly the perfect way to do it, because he does not give you a lot of time with that at all. 
get ready though, because he's gonna be using that handgun a lot. So, yep, there it is. Ooh! Yeah, that thing comes to play too. Holy shit! Wow! I've never had that happen before! I have never beat him that quickly in this level ever. What the fuck just happened? I'm like stunned! <laughs> I am completely and utterly stunned on what I just saw. I didn't even have that charged up any more than like the 6th bar, 6th or 7th bar I think. I must have just placed it perfectly, or something. As bad as I want to use the white bomb here, I probably shouldn't. Oh, great. Okay, here we go. This is not gonna be fun. Yeah, look at all this bullshit. It's gonna be Owl City Projectile Edition here today. Ooh, ah. You remember, you can't shoot full things at her. You just can't. Oh, sweet, I didn't even use a bomb on Cobra, so I'm gonna be... I'm gonna be right as rain if I don't fucking die. Hey, there we go. We got a chance yet to kill Big Vagina Woman. It kinda looks smooth. Oh, I thought I had it. There we go. I did still get you. God, stop having so many damn orifices to shoot at me from. Alright. Can we escape? Can we escape? I'm gonna charge this thing up to the bitter end. Yeah! Go, shoot you right in your... That's like having dry socket, is what I imagine that being like. Just having a big gaping hole that's just exposed nerves and everything. There we go! She actually wasn't even that hard, as strangely as that sounds. It took me about as long to beat her in this mode as it did in the other one. But now, the important thing is that we haven't had to use a bomb in two levels. Because we're gonna need all four of those just for this guy. <laughs> good old Vervius isn't gonna make my life any easier. There's a very good reason why we saved that wide bomb, too i.e. for him. So, unfortunately we ran out of time, but when we come back next time, we'll hope to God that we can get around the last two levels of this. I'm not going to count on anything happening, though, because Vervius is a fucking piece of shit. Wrapped in bacon, on a piece of wood, over an open fire, with Indians rain dancing around it, singing Just the Way You Are by Bruno Mars, crawling on their hands and knees. Yeah, that's how bad that level is going to be. That's what that is. So, I will see you guys next time, and uh, we'll give it a try. Or two, or thirty. <laughs>